Hey beautiful beaders, welcome to M&M channel where we show you how to make authentic beaded jewelry for yourself, your family, your friends and special people in your life. Please subscribe to this channel, like, share and keep watching this video till the end. For this project, you'll need black, red, white, and shiny green beads. You'll also need nylon monofilament line, also known as fishing line, which should be 0.3 mm in diameter. And a pair of scissors. So, I'm going to show you how we are going to bead. We'll start beading from the green bead up to the black bead, then bead across until we complete our bracelet. So that is how we are going to make the first part of the Kenyan flag bracelet. So go ahead and cut your fishing line so that we can start beading. Okay, fold your fishing line into half. Using the thread that is on your right hand side, pick four green beads. Then pass the fishing line that is on your left hand side through the last green bead that you entered and pull it down. Using the fishing line that is on your right hand side, pick one white bead and one white bead on your left hand side. Then pick a red bead on your right hand side. Then pass the fishing line that is on your left hand side through the last red bead that you entered and pull it down. Using the fishing line that is on your right hand side, pick one red bead and one red bead on the other side. Then one red bead on your right hand side, like so. Then pass the fishing line through the last red bead that you entered and pull it down. So the next step is to pick one white bead on the right hand side and one white bead on the left hand side. Then one black bead on your right hand side. Then pass the fishing line through the last black bead that you entered and pull it down. Using the fishing line on your left hand side, pick three black beads. Then pass the fishing line that is on your right hand side through the last black bead that you entered and pull it down. So the fishing line should lie on the side, like so. Then using the fishing line that is, that is facing upwards, pick three black beads. Then using the other fishing line, pass it through the last black bead that you entered. And pull it down. I'm going to turn my bracelet upside down so that we can continue beading. So pass the fishing line on your right hand side through the next white bead and pull it down. Using the fishing line on your left hand side, pick one white and one red bead. Then pass the other fishing line through the last red bead that you entered and pull it down. Then pass the fishing line 
on your right hand side through the next red bead. Then pick one red bead and one red bead. Then pass the other fishing line through the last red bead that you entered. And pull it down. Then pass the fishing line that is on your right hand side through the next white bead, like so, and pull it down. Then pick, sorry, one white bead and one green bead. Then pass the other fishing line through the last green bead that you entered and pull it down. Then pass the fishing line that is on your right hand side through the next green bead, like so. I'm going to turn my bracelet so that we can continue beading. So pick two green beads. Then pass the fishing line through the last green bead that you entered. Like so and pull it down. The next step, pick three green beads. Using the fishing line that is facing downwards. Then pass the other fishing line through the last green bead that you entered and pull it down. Then using the fishing line on your left hand side, pass it through the next white bead. Then pick one white bead and one red bead. Then pass the other fishing line through the last red bead that you entered and pull it down. Then pass the fishing line on your left hand side through the next red bead. Using the thread on your right hand side, pick two red beads. Like so and pass the other fishing line through the last red bead that you entered. Then pass the fishing line on your left hand side through the last white bead that you entered. Then pick one white bead and one black bead. Then pass the other fishing line through the last black bead that you entered and pull it down. Then using the fishing line on your left hand side, pass it through the next black bead. Using the fishing line facing upwards, pick two black beads. Then pass the fishing line through the last black bead that you entered and pull it down. So this is how your bracelet should look like so far.